NOAA has changed the La Nina outlook for this winter and how could that impact snowfall across the Midwest? Here's the map. When you get into a very weak La Nina, basically to Enzo neutral is what we call it when you're not El Nino or La Nina, you're kind of somewhere just in the middle, things are normal. This is what the map produces. You look at data since 1959, much of the state kind of has a brown hue and the brown hue shows you near or slightly below average snowfall. There have been some weak La Nina winters though, where we've seen a little bit more snow in parts of central and southwestern Indiana. Every winter is different. It just takes one storm system to kind of change all the averages up. But you may have seen a lot of different posts from random places talking about, this is gonna be the snowiest winter ever with La Nina. There never was gonna be that strong in the first place. And honestly, as our weather team, we weren't sure how long it was going to last. So that's why we haven't actually produced a snowfall outlook, but it looks like it could end even faster than we all thought. So back to kind of normalish conditions. I know that doesn't sound crazy or exciting, but normal snowfall, this is the map of what an average snowy year would bring here to Indiana.